if you watch my last video, I bought this motherboard and it arrived just in the motherboard box, unfortunately from Amazon and it's never happened before and um, it looks like the motherboard had been moved around quite a bit, obviously, so I was in desperate need of testing it out. I have been waiting for a Ryzen 5600 to arrive, but then I ended up just getting a Ryzen 3300X just to actually test it. I got it for 50 bucks, so I don't mind the cost. I could just use it as a test chip. But upon actually wiring it all up and then getting the graphics card plugged in and everything, I, I didn't actually get a boot. Um, I'm really gutted. I don't actually know what to do here. This was an expensive build, it being a mini ITX. At this stage, I don't know if it's the graphics card. I don't know if it's the motherboard. I don't know if it's a CPU. Um, there's just no lights or on this motherboard that tells you what's actually going on. So I am hoping maybe it's the BIOS, but Honestly, that it says a 3300X is actually supported on all biases for this ASRock motherboard. It's an ASRock A520, I believe, and I am super gutted. I don't really know what I'm going to do next. I might, I might have to test this graphics card on my primary system and might have to wait for the 5600 to arrive and test that chip instead of the 3300X. Um, I really hope it's not the motherboard because I ordered it from Amazon and it did arrive within the box and that sort of thing. I just don't know if I can return it.